Um, so you so you bought something March first. That was your first purchase, was yes. it? Yes. Yes. Right. So that would that will account. Right. See, now that's tricky. I don't know how that's going to work then, because normally if you upgrade and then you make a purchase, it'll pay you for the rest of that month and the following month. So I believe that. Have you been getting any profit pools? Yes. Payments? Yes. Yes. In March from yes. that one purchase. Yes. Yeah. So I believe that you'll be paid for all of March and that I'll account for all of April as well. But you've made a second purchase in March, have you? Yes, just a couple of days ago. Right. So you'll be, which platform was that from? Uh, platform. Which was it One Direct or yes. was it? Yeah, TPA? One Direct. Uh, right. So with One Direct, you need to make a purchase before the 15th uh, for it to qualify for the following month. So I'm not sure how. I believe you'd probably be okay for April if you made that purchase on the 1st and it started paying you straight away because it's your first purchase after upgrading because normally a purchase made pays you for the following month. But I think because you've been paid straight away uh -huh. for that first one that you are probably okay for April. Um, so, but the first, the first one, March 1st, I made purchase off just the TPS yeah general that's it. stuff right it yeah, wasn't yeah. anything off direct one direct, one direct so i decided yeah. to see what one direct had to offer so that i went in there and i ordered like I yeah know, it was like 78 dollars or something so i think you'll be fine for april's payments because if your purchase your first very first purchase was on march 1st because they that was your first one after upgrading because that's yeah. what they do you see so you, you're like normally when you upgrade you then make the purchase, they pay you straight away because it's your first time. Okay. Be because, and then you make your next one in, obviously, uh, you make your next one at the end of April, you can make your next one, and then that'll pay you for May. Okay, so so the next purchase that I need to make would be in April? In, in April, yeah. By, by what time frame? Well, if it's one direct, then it needs to be before the 15th, or if it's on incentive buys before the 15th. But if it's just TPS, then Anytime. anywhere, but don't leave it too late. Yeah. Okay. But, okay. Yeah. Okay. Just so I understand, you know, yeah. as we move forward. So, yeah. That's and it's cool. good for me to understand this as people ask that too, you know. Yeah. So. That's it. I'm, st I'm still learning as I go. Yeah. Uh, I, don't, I don't know it all yet. Okay. Probably never will. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, really yeah there's always something new to learn so yeah that's it that's it yeah but i'm gonna start using some videos um like you said with you and philip and you know put on my fan page and just get some more curiosity just by uh leveraging your videos that you mm. guys do you know and then naturally i'll have my opinion whatever on the post but i think i'm gonna start yeah. doing that yeah yeah, I mean, that one I did with Philip, I think it's really good because he sums it up very well, uh, especially if people have probably been looking at your posts already and know a little bit about it. Um, and it kind of, Phil explains it really well. And I, I give my my little um, opinion as well in there. But yeah. Okay. Let's share away. Yeah. Yeah. It's good viral. That's Come. what we're doing. It comes from a, a different perspective too, especially with TPS being so new and not a lot of people knowing about it. If they are watching you and they aren't connected to someone else inside of TPS, then it's like, wow, she's the only one talking about this. <laughs> you know? yeah. So if you're sharing that kind of stuff, then people are like, oh, wait, so there's more people. Then they go searching around a little bit and start seeing all the connections and then they come back to you and they go, okay, so tell me about this TPS. <laughs> you know? Yeah. Okay. that's it people okay. watch people watch so for so long don't they and then all of a sudden they'll reach out to you yeah and they've, they've been watching all along um but yeah so just keep consistent don't worry um if you're not getting any bites because people they are watching you definitely yeah just go keep going yeah, yeah, for me, the one thing that's been working really well on Facebook is definitely like the pictures, like that picture that I took of the, um, the, the box, target, target box. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 
I got two people who said they were signing up. One actually did. The other one will today. And then I've got probably two or three extra people that are now on my new this week list of to talk to and things like that. Cause that's how I go about it. Like I have this little notepad and every week I decide who I'm going to bring back over. You know, if I've, if I've reached out to somebody three times and they haven't taken the time to watch the video or they keep making up excuses, just go I, the next fl one. I flip the page and yep, I start yep. up with a new list, you know, yep. just obviously they need to keep watching, you yep. know? So yeah. How often do you follow up with those people? Sam? A lot. Um, no, but a lot. Watching. No, I knocking on their not. door. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I, uh, the <laughs> I, I actually, here yet? <laughs> I actually, <laughs> most of the people are coming over to me and asking, like, what is this? And so at that point, I go over and I do not. Like the other day, someone was like, I need, I need a link. Send me a link. And it was just, that's all they wrote. And I said, well, hi, how are you? A link to what? Yeah. Because if I send yeah. them a link to my enrollment, because that's the excitement where I yeah. want to go with it, yeah. then they're like, no, that's not what I wanted. I wanted to see yeah. a video. So, yeah, you know, yeah. the first initial conversation, I'm just finding out, like, have they seen anything? What Who are they, they following? So you know, yeah, like, what's going on? The one guy was like, I've seen a few videos. So I'm assuming that he's seen the videos, like, on my shopwithsammy.com, because you know, us inside of my late system pro or whatever, we have those capture pages set up. So I know who's coming through and watching the videos. Um, so I'm assuming that he's watched on the shop with Sammy, which is our landing page for the TPS um, super affiliates. Mm -hmm. So I sent him over the other one, you know, and he was like, I'm looking for the, the sizzle, the thing that's going to make me. And I was like, this was what, this was the video that did it for me. And then I'll yeah. go back and I'll ask, did you watch it? No, I got busy. Okay, well, mm. when are you going to? Oh, probably tomorrow. Yeah. Okay. Then I check back in. Then on my third time, I literally say, I'm not going to bother you anymore. But if you need any more information, you come back and let me know. And then at that point, they're like, you're not bothering me. Hold on. I tried to do this. you know. And it's like, yeah. all of a sudden, they change their gears because yeah. I'm not going to pay attention to you anymore. I got to yeah. go. Yeah. You know? I can't, I'm not, I've been down the road of please join me, please join me, please join me. And I'm not doing that anymore because no. I spend too much time. No more. <laughs> yeah, no more. No more. <laughs> you definitely can't drag people with you. That's, that's been my problem too many times is sometimes you want it almost too much for someone else. Right. Yeah. You just, you just want to go, I do not give a shit if you join or not. Yep. Yeah. And it works. Because what I have yeah. is good i'm gonna if you don't join someone else will join tomorrow that's yep. right that's right and yep. it is it is a loss and also when you're following up something i always say i assume i kind of assume they've watched it and i always say you know so you've seen the video what did you like best because it promotes a better response than what did you think because they'll always go, well, you know, they'll mm -hmm. think of the negative stuff. Yeah, what yeah. did you like best? Yeah. And then I'll go, well, I like the fact that I can shop on Walmart. Well, did you know, blah, blah. And then expand on that and ask them what else they liked. And then you're steering it in a good, good direction. Because most yeah. people like to moan about stuff. So that's my little input. That's what I say to people. Yeah. No, I ask yes. because that's always been, one, sorry, whoever I cut off. That's always been one of my not strong suits is the following up. Um, mm. Something I'm working on for myself to just be like, like you said, I don't give a shit. Yeah, you just, I think I, I'm, yeah. I'm helping a lad in my uh, town who's joined. He's upgrading on the first and he's like, oh, I'll get people interested. And then like, they seem to back off. And I was like, well, what are you saying? He sent me a snapshot of their conversation and he just like verbal diarrhea all over the screen. Like, blah, blah, blah. I'm like, mate, you've said far too much. Like say a quarter of what you've said because he's got excited. So he's trying to give them something else cool to like sell them when they're already interested. He's like, he's throwing more bait when he's already caught the fish. And I'm like, just calm down, mate, calm down. Like to, you don't, you just need to just be, yeah, whatever. Okay. You know, I think the least amount of information that you give is actually better because, and, and that's, mm. that's the, that's what I always tell people too, is it's like, 
we we get so excited and we know that ours is better than anybody else's but yet when we get a message across you know just like the other day this woman came across and i was I literally i had to pull myself away from it because i was like i'm engaging in this and i don't need to be engaging but she was like i can get you all the traffic you need i'm like where's where's your blog you know like what are you using and she's like oh i don't have a blog i just so you promote something but you don't use it you know and it was just like back and forth back and forth and i was like she she didn't even take the time i don't even think that she knew i had brown hair you know like i mean she didn't even take the time to find out anything about me and yet for some reason we will turn around and do the same thing that they did because we're excited you know and ours is different but you just have to pay attention to those those messages in your messenger and if the, somebody's annoying you Make sure to make a mental note and don't do it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Well, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a class on how to speak English because <laughs> the English language is so enticing, Gavin. When I listen to you, I listen because I'm really paying attention to how you speak. And so I think, really? that, you know, I, I know a little Spanish, but I think I'm going <laughs> to. I'm going to take a course on how to develop this accent because it's lovely. It's very Oh, nice. right. Well, that's good. I mean, I don't think that's anything to do with, you know, how I've got on, but if it worked, well, maybe. No, it does because I will tell you last week, Joe's like, his voice was so cool. <laughs> yes. <laughs> it's bump. Yeah. 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 Well, it's only cool to you guys because you're not. Yeah. You don't hear it all the time. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> So maybe when I'm talking to English people, I should put on a different accent. <laughs> hey, Espanol, well, you know. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I, I, actually, no, I won't. Because it will sound terrible. <laughs> so, yeah, I think, I think okay, uh, yeah, communication is big. Like, if you're one of these... Oh, I've just spilled water down my uh, desk. What an idiot. Uh, yeah, if you're the sort of person that doesn't have any sort of energy in your voice some people are like yeah tps mm -hmm. pretty good right yeah 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 you know what i mean you've got to sorry i've just got a thing i just spilled uh yeah i think energy in your voice and being i keep saying it but being excited you know yeah the you voice look at the memos. people's yeah, the excitement nice. doesn't come across, and I've said this in the past to some people on my team, previous team. Excitement doesn't come across in a, in a Facebook message or in a thing like you no. can. Hi, how are yeah. you? You got to get voice to voice, and Zoom yeah. is great. But even I, you yeah. know, got to get people on the phone. They've got to hear what you're saying, not just you know you're yeah. typing with all this passion, but they don't hear you banging the crap out of your keyboard that you're no. so excited. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I use I use the voice memos all the time, as Sammy will tell you. Um, you know, and you, I have to be honest with you. She told me that was a week or so ago, and it never even occurred to me to use it until she said it. I was like, "Yeah, really? do it <laughs> right there." Have, it especially with hurt. especially with new people, like brand new, just connected. Send them a voice message. I know it might you might feel a little bit uncomfortable, but don't. Just be excited. Just yeah. like you chatting to one of your buddies. Like, hey, so so, thanks for the connection, blah blah blah, just super short. And they play that and they go, Oh, that's nice. Bit of personal, yeah. People I tell me that. how nice that is. People tell me how nice that is. Yeah, the guy from Sweden, he said, The fact that you sent me voice memos and we had a good chat, he said that made me want to talk to you more. So, <laughs> well, like when Gavin and I first met, <clears throat> we met, I was doing lives and he. I don't know where he saw me or whatnot. You follow. He... You did the follow okay. thing where you follow people. And then I was like, oh, right, look to your profile as I do it. Yeah, I'll send her a friend's request. It works. That's what you do. But I tried the follow thing. It never works for me. No one adds me. <laughs> really? Maybe they look at my profile and go, hmm. No, <laughs> it's tougher. It, I have to say, I have to imagine the follow thing is tougher for you for being a man because I get proposed to three or four times a week. <laughs> Really? <laughs> yeah. I just, I'll I just, I'll go into the profile, I'll like and comment on a couple of their posts and send them a friend's request and then when they accept to send them a voice memo. That's I, think, my I just think that women are, women are, I think they're a little apprehensive because there's a lot of people who are um, not genuine out there and sometimes 
I, I just recently, like, you know, I've even gotten a couple of burn requests through TPS and I go look and I'm like, who do they know that I know? And I've only accepted them because like, like you and I now have mutual friends or something. Yeah. It, some of these people, they're, they're crazy. Yeah. Yeah. No, so Sam, Sam, Sammy followed me and then I started following her and then I saw the stuff she was putting out, the lives, and I started jumping on your lives a lot. And you, you, you give these cool little tips and I'd utilize them. And I learned a lot from Sammy. There's loads of little bits that I picked up from Sammy's lives. And then she was like, you got to get on lives. And I was like, right, I'm going to do it. And I started doing lives and it was the most horrendous thing ever when you first... <laughs> When you're doing, doing that first one, I sat here with this, I sat in this seat in this, op- in this room going, right, I'll do it in a minute. And I put the phone down and I'm like, oh God. And I'm looking at it and I'm like, oh no, I can't do it. I can't do it. And then it took me 20 minutes to hit go live. And then it starts counting down. And I'm like, oh, three, two, one. I'm like, oh, I I wasn't ready for the drama. Somehow I hid myself. <laughs> yeah. Somehow I hid myself. I can see me when I talk, but that's it. I'm on YouTube, Pamela. Yeah, I remember the first time I saw I saw Gavin on the live, and I'm like, and it was like a completely different connection because we had been talking through Messenger, and it was type at the time. We were not doing voice memos, and when I saw his live, I was like. Oh my gosh! Like, cause you have a different view when you're when you see images, and then you do that, and then when you actually see someone on a video, it's like a whole different connection that you get. It's crazy. <laughs> it's either like they're weird. No, cause he's so funny. You know, it's like <laughs> so funny. Oh great. <laughs> Your your one video cracks me up <laughs> about how to how to post in groups. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that one that was a yeah pre-recorded edited one that I did. Yeah, that that sounds hilarious. Now. Well, we're probably Is that the one with the start. car and showing all the money. <laughs> yeah, the car with the money on the keyboard. That crack me up. Don't forget the dice. Yeah. The dice are key. <laughs> the random little dice. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I, don't know, I don't know what happened there. I just found the dice and thought I'd throw that in. Yeah. It's hilarious. Yeah, so, so I think lives are huge, yeah. Mm-hmm. Video anyway. Absolutely. It's just going to, it. like we said before, you know, we're, we're at the very beginning of this wave. And the faster you jump on it and become TPS, the person that knows TPS, the person that was in TPS first, you know, the whole works, it, the faster it's just going to happen for you. Because as soon as we start hitting those serious, you know, caterpillars and getting into the U.S. getting bigger and things like that, it's going to be you because you've got the lives out there. You've got all the, you know, things. Yeah, um, totally. But we're running, we're going to probably be running low. I just want to run through and find out if anyone has any questions or anything like that. So Brenda, do you have anything? No, I haven't been able to do a lot. I still got a sick baby. You can probably see her head right here. So I, I do it up and on this weekend and hope she's feeling better, but. I'm good for now. I'll get a hold of you if I do. Okay. And what about you, Pamela? How are you doing? I'm hidden. <laughs> we can see you the whole time. I, I hid myself and I can't get out. <laughs> Anyways, um, I'm good. And thank you very much for helping me uh fix that page yesterday um i've got people talking to me about it and then when they find out they have to spend some money they're like i'm not doing it so whatever see ya people like that move on to the next person i just keep moving on to the next person i'm gonna get a yes sooner or later Mm -hmm. yeah so i'm not giving up it's a numbers game yeah yep and just really make sure that your mindset 
is on the, you know, proper, I'm okay with spending a hundred dollars a month or whatever, you know, when you talk to someone, make sure that you already have that type of mindset going into it as well, but you are going to run into people like that. And the truth is, is it's like, when I talk to people, you know, I've had people who have said, well, I just don't understand why when, when you upgrade, you have to get a kit. And I'm like, you have to get a kit. In my opinion, it's a, a benefit. Like, yeah. Why are they well, even giving you products? Giving a product. Yeah. Yeah. So, it's, it's, yeah. it's a hurdle, isn't it? It's like, oh, you actually get products. I've got to take delivery of something. I can't. Yeah. <laughs> it surprises me when they ask me that, boy, and then I tell them, you know, you're yes, you're spending this money, but you're getting something for it. You're not just giving them money. You're going to get what you ordered. You know, there's something on there that you're going to want. Just look at it. There's something on there you're going to want. And they don't, they just are not, they don't get it. And I, I tell them as many different ways as I can. You're going to get product. You're going to get what you order. Um, and they're just, idiots. wow. Yeah. And, you know, you... <clears throat> you can go into all these different groups and stuff like that. You know, there's tons of different people out there, people who, you know, go over to a Walmart like page or fan page or whatever, and, you know, start interacting with those people and say, Hey, did you know that you can affiliate with, you know, Walmart or anything like that? You know, that's a, cause people are like, no, I mean, I, I think it was Rudy that I was talking to. Um, and he said that, when he goes and picks up his stuff from Walmart, he literally talks to the people and is like, did you know that, you know, I'm making money, I'm affiliated with them. And Walmart people are like, what, you know, like, what do you mean? Because nobody knows about it, you know? So yeah. even, even when you're shopping somewhere, you know, stuff like that. Yeah. I was in, I was at Macy's and we were looking for cologne and the sale. I felt actually felt bad because the sales girl was all over the sale, and we were just trying to find which one Joe wanted to yeah. order it through Macy's through my through my link, and she was really trying. I said, "We're not buying anything. Don't go." You know, I didn't mean to be rude, but I was like, "Go over there and help us. <laughs> people. You're not purchasing." She's like, "Try oh, it." I didn't go home. And I said, time. "Really, I'm going to order this on the website. So just stop." You know? Yeah. 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 It's hard okay. to sell something you can't, uh, perfume you can't smell. Yeah, that's it, yeah. So, yeah, people will go in and, you know, like a post I did the other day saying, like, experts will predict that by 2022 that retail stores will be nothing more than showrooms. And people will go in, try stuff on, go home and buy it because they're either being rewarded or it's cheaper or something, you know. Like as like I said in another post, in the future it won't people's choice in where they buy won't be on the price. It'll be on the experience, whether it's customer service or they're getting paid. You know, it's not all about price because if they're going somewhere and getting a better experience, so people will pay a little bit more for that. Absolutely. You know, and <clears throat> I sometimes order stuff off places that I know like from a mountain biking is a particular site I'll use because their customer service is bob on and they're really good and they're you know so I'll go there and pay a little bit more rather than somewhere cheaper that I know I might have hassle with deliveries or whatever and that's why people will come to TPS because they can earn a residual income from it yep I did have someone ask me they were like so why does why do people want to want to, you know, like, why does Walmart and Target and all these big companies want to link up with TPS? And at first I was like, I don't know. You and then I'm like, yeah. yeah. And then I, and then I'm like, well, it makes sense that you're, you're getting rewarded for being loyal. You know, I mean, and now that everything's going, I mean, we were up North and my husband saw an old mall that has been complete. It's just dirt now. It's just a dirt field. Now it was a mall that he grew up going to, you know, and it's gone. And with that happening and with people like, you know, us who could be coming out with our own toys, our own products. And if we know how to market it well enough, we can take over, you know? So Walmart has to get the loyal people who are getting rewarded for coming to their store and things like that with our mm -hmm. 
you know, now we can buy stuff over in China, over, you know, I mean, we can buy stuff anywhere now. So when someone does ask you something like that, you know, it's just, it's a loyalty program, basically. Mm -hmm. I mean, just think about it. If, if TPS Is he breaking out for you guys? Yeah. Yeah. You're breaking out. Right now. You want to put products? Are you up for it? What are we going to say there? Oh, oh, sorry, breaking up. Can you hear me now? Yes. Yeah, I was saying that basically, you know, if you approach a company and go, do you want to list your products on our site that's got 2 million members currently, nearly? Why wouldn't you? Like, you've just got l loads more eyeballs on your products. So it makes sense. It makes sense for everybody. Members, the retailers, the company. Everybody wins. It's not yeah. like somebody's making all the money and someone else is losing out. We're all winning. Mm -hmm. I'll tell you what, so we've got to get to GVP, everybody. GVP. That's the way. GVP is not. Yeah. Load of money. <laughs> 15 to 30 grand a month, roughly. A lot of money. Wow. That took it me five years to get there. You think it'd be worth it? Absolutely. Yep. You know, the people, yeah. I have to say, my coworkers, they're all like, oh, tell me more. And then when I try to tell them more, they you know back off whatever i'll keep hacking away at them but they're you know i'm like listen you don't understand i work here then i go home and i do this and i do that and other things that i do i'm like i want to work this hard because i i don't want to have to work this hard in the future mm -hmm. i go i don't want to actually at walmart i don't want to stay at walmart and be a greeter when i'm 65 years old because i need money yeah. because i you know i don't want to have to be at disney world because i live three hours outside disney world I don't want to be counting people onto rides because I don't have enough money to make my ends meet. I'm like, those people don't want to stand there eight, 10 hours a day counting people onto rides. And can I be in the front? And my baby doesn't like this. They don't want to listen to that stuff. I don't want to listen to it. And I'm there on vacation. So yes, I totally want to, while you're home watching, you know, whatever, I'm not watching whatever and I'm working and it's totally going to pay off for me. Mm -hmm. so, yeah, this is, you know, you know what we're doing right now? This is classed as work. How cool is that? I know. <laughs> Way better than where I'm going tomorrow, I'll tell you that right now. <laughs> so, but think, well, I'm off Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Yeah. But yeah, you know, you think about this, this having these Zoom calls, although there's no plan to it, just us chatting and sort of fueling each other's minds. And, you know, there's uh, something I have took from this today is what Sammy said with, you know, if someone likes or comments on your post, just thank them for it. And that's something I've probably not done, but I will do from now. And you don't know where that's going to lead. You know, the simplest of things can have a massive effect. So, yeah, these Zoom calls are great. You know, I, I do one regular with one of my teams in the UK. And I'll jump on these whenever you guys want to do them because I think it's brilliant for us to all sort of work yeah. and chat, you know, just mixing with people that are on the same path as you has more effect than you think it really does it yeah, really does because the other people will just suck the life right out of your dream because they you know yeah. they're not mm, yeah, i don't yeah. know the word but they don't want that path yeah. but they don't want you to go down that path either so it's definitely better to be able to stay because sometimes you're not surrounded by like-minded people and it's not so easy to find them yeah that's true oh, the coals burn hot no. <laughs> Yeah, I totally agree. I think it's uh, it's vital. That's why I chat to Dale and Philip on a daily basis and anybody else in TPS. I really get myself involved in that community and um, really push the conversations with everybody. Um, yeah, it's important. I think that's it's good that we have this too. Because like, like Melissa said, when you don't have anybody that sees the positive of what you're doing, I mean, yeah, you can text, you can do this all the time, but when you have face-to-face -face like we are, it helps yeah. a lot, too. Yeah, that's true. You know. Yeah. Totally. Yeah. And the more you show up, the more people below you will show up, too. You mm -hmm. know, they'll be like, oh, well, and then, you know, when we all get back and we go to the chat or whatever, and we're like, oh, my gosh, it was awesome. Everybody's like, wait, what, what? We're, you got to do, you know, as, as much as we want to do the curiosity and all of that stuff with our audience, 
is as much as we need to also be doing it with our team because we need to keep them energized. We need to keep them excited. We need to make sure that they're getting tapped in and plugged in as well. You know, so many times we tend to focus going towards more people, more people, more people, more people. And as long as you got a few on your team that are willing to work, then just run with them, you know, and keep them excited. Yeah, like I said earlier, just touching base with the people in your team. Like I talk to Sammy every day and just generally as many people in my team as I can because, like you say, just keeping them energized is good, as well as obviously talking to new people. Yeah. Oh, what's that? Um, mm -hmm. Someone have TV on? <laughs> yeah, someone's got TV on. I'm not guilty today. Stop with me. <laughs> I am not guilty today. I'm the only one I think my kids are SpongeBob. <laughs> SpongeBob. <laughs> you guys know me. There's always SpongeBob. I'm SpongeBob out here. <laughs> Well, he does live in a pineapple under the sea. I mean, I'm just saying. Right. And it's so funny. We'll go to the store and they'll be like, there's SpongeBob's house. Aww. Aww. We've actually made one here. We've bought a spun, uh, pineapple and Keegan's drawn it. That really. That's awesome. Well, awesome. We're coming down on the last um, little bit of time. I want to, first of all, thank you guys so much for coming out. Um, Thank you for your excitement. Thank you for you guys, all that you do every day. And I know a lot of you, I work, you know, one-on-one -on -one with all of you. And I know a lot of you don't give yourself enough credit. Um, and I just know from getting on Facebook and watching every one of you that you guys are doing amazing things and just keep up the amazing work. I'm extreme i mean like i said when i get into these chats and i see you guys names i'm just like yeah <laughs> you know it's just it's really exciting so thank you guys all so much for all of your hard work yes let's do it yes let's do it you know what i like to bring a challenge um to everybody here is if we can get two or three new prospects this week can we set up a time to do a zoom with you and and Gavin, and Absolutely. introduce TPS to them as, as a as a group. And sometimes people want to see what's it all about. And I don't know how everybody feels about that, but it's kind of kind of like a fun thing to do. Yeah, I think as uh, long as they've seen some sort of information beforehand. Um, yeah. Okay. Because trying to explain the whole thing to someone over a Zoom call without the slides and stuff is a mission. Um, okay. So they've seen. They've seen at least like the the ten minute video or whatever video you show them, get them like interested, and then I'll jump on Zoom calls at any point. I say okay. to my team, like if you want to get someone on and show an interest, I'll talk to them because I can get them signed up. Okay. Okay. Yeah, the, the Zoom definitely helps, and especially like you know if you do a three way with Gavin or I or whoever. Um, you know, just to have two people who are like, oh my gosh, and oh my gosh, and that, that excitement, yeah. and they see the they see the video, and they're like, okay, well, I want to be part of this, <laughs> you know? Yeah. 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 I mean, it's okay. obviously, because of time zones for me, it's better on sort of, like, Saturday, Sundays, um, but yeah, that's good for me. I'm good for that. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Um, and then I don't know if you guys are in for it, but I think that one challenge would be at least one live this week. Okay. You, think you guys, you think you guys oh! could do that? <laughs> yes. Just yes. one. Just one. Just one. I don't okay. care. Yeah. I don't care if it's two yeah. minutes. I don't care if it's turn it on and say, <laughs> hi, I'm Lynn. Click. <laughs> yeah. yeah, just get, get on and talk about, uh, well, even if it's not about TPS, just let people see your face. If it's, like if say, it's your, you, yeah. If you, if, if you just see you, you, know, you on the camera, uh, people will go, oh, they're nice. Have a chat with them. You know, yep. and uh, it just out like Sammy said, it helps with the connection. Like, you can think you know someone, like them, and then as soon as they get on video, that further connection is huge. Yes. So, okay. And just say, you know, you can literally be like, first live totally out outside of my comfort zone and you'll be and you'll be amazed you'll be like you'll probably have more views on that than anything over the next <laughs> yeah. while but be, because be, everybody wants be to vulnerable. see it 
Yeah. Be vulnerable. Make mistakes. Tell people you're nervous. Yep. People love that. Okay. And don't don't right. over because I've done it too. I get hot and cold with my lives. But don't overthink it. Just whatever it is, start talking. My lives never end with what I start with. I'll talk about the sky <laughs> being blue, and then I will talk end it with snow in, yeah. in Washington. <laughs> 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 Yeah, I, I, I go with the subject and then I kind of wing it. But sometimes, like yeah. my, my, I did one on rapport building. I actually had a few points I wanted to cover. So I wrote them on a piece of paper in a marker and stuck it beneath the camera on a tripod so I could remember those. But then I winged it off of those subjects and then I recapped. So for me, that, get, that gave me, I've never done that before. And I've been doing lives a while, but I found that helped to make sure I covered all the killer points I wanted to do without going completely off track and forgetting. Okay, I accept that challenge this right. week. Good. <laughs> ah! I'm in. in. Yeah. I'm with you, Lynn. I've never done one either. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Brenda. Tells me all the time. <laughs> They're yeah. powerful. Yeah. No, they yeah. really, they really do work. And even, you know, I'm sure you guys have seen the, I think everyone saw my drunken one when I was at the con that little concert. Um, it it gets a lot of engagement to your page. Yeah, it is. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Okay. I'll no problem. To them. People right. want that reality. All right. Well, thank you guys. We're looking forward to one live, one Facebook live this week. Yeah. <laughs> <Woo -hoo. laughs> and then any three way Zooms or anything, let me know. Okay. I yeah, will cool. be 100% there. Okay. okay. Thanks, guys. All right, Thank guys. You. Have a good Bye. Sunday. Have a good Bye. day. Bye. 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 Bye.